Hi, I'm Mike Morovich, and this is Ask an Expert. As an engineer at American Structure Point, I work on a lot of roundabouts. And during the public information phase, people always ask, well, why not just go with a regular stop sign or traffic signal? Well, today I'm going to talk about how reduced conflict points in a roundabout can help make it a safer intersection. So let's start out by looking at a traditional four-way stopper signal. With one lane in each direction, I have here a movement uh, drawn for each a uh, movement that a vehicle can make through the intersection. That can be a right turn, a left turn, or a through movement. The next thing we'll do is count up all the points where those lines intersect. Each one of those points is what we call a conflict point. It's an opportunity for two vehicles to potentially intersect and get in an accident. If we count up all the conflict points in a traditional intersection, there's a total of 32. Now let's look at a single lane roundabout. If we do the same exercise, we find that the only conflict points are where vehicles are entering and exiting. Leaving a total of eight conflict points in a single lane roundabout. That's four times fewer than the traditional intersection. Less conflict points results in less accidents in the real world making this uh, one of the decision makers for choosing a roundabout over a traditional intersection. Well, that's it for this episode of Ask an Expert. If you have any questions, reach out to us on Twitter at hashtag AskAnExpert.